Hello, and welcome back to Nine Souls in the museum. It feels like... Oh, right, yeah. That was, uh... I still have this, like... The boss fight, Lady Ethereal save. I was considering playing more of that, but I think I'm just gonna pass for now. Yeah, Tesla Grad is on sale. Yeah, I've seen that on sale many times. I also, I already have the, like, sort of spiritual successor to Tesla Grad that I would want to play. Which one was that again? It was called something, and I don't remember. And yeah, I just, I feel like, oh, I can't play that until I play Tesla Grad, right? But I'm not so sure I really want to play Tesla Grad, but yeah, it does look nice enough. Out. You missed last Nine Souls? Yeah, we just, like, went around, did some museum stuff. Found out lore about some old men. Oh yeah, I have this this thing on. I guess I'll keep having that. Which, I still have water flow, yeah. I'll test that out a bit. Yeah, World to the West, that's the one. I think I got that in, like, a, a bundle or something. Right, I removed the gold thing. That doesn't sound sensible. Who would want to do such a thing? Yeah, I just... I don't even want that. <laughs> Back to this. But then... What do we have instead? I don't really have any other, like... Maybe we just get rid of this one. Because, like, yeah, it's nice, but I mean, I can collect it. But then again, as soon as I take this off, I know I'm going to get annoyed by having to collect stuff. So I guess we can take this one. I thought you said old man lore of Bololo, which also would have made sense. So where was this like door? I remember we had a big door that I want to go into. Was it like down here? Yeah, this one. So I guess let's go do that. Bololo. Oh, I see you're not an Age of Empires player. Oh, wait. This is... Yep, never mind. I thought we were already... There. You're not an old man. Yeah, I guess I deserve that. Ow. Yeah, Ricochet Jade is pretty okay. Wait, where am I going? I want to go, like, down here, right? But I really like the charge attack stuff, mostly. Yeah, here we go. This is where I wanted to go. Right! Oh, right! That's why I had the stuff on! Oh, I completely forgot we were like... Oh, dear. I forgot we were doing a mini-boss fight. Okay, alright. Hold on. Yeah. Okay, now that makes sense why I swapped off the gold thing. guy is kind of weird. At least you can, like, just run back, run away and heal, and then get back. Yeah, he's, like, kind of a a mix between, like, these clone dudes and also the previous, like, dagger, like, poison guys or whatever with the bombs and stuff.
This is like the easiest attack. Damn. Ah, damn, I was just gonna like hook shot up. Okay, yep. Yeah, now I like now I remember why I swapped off the gold, so I guess let's do that. Hey, yeah, I leveled up at least. Yeah. Let's go back to that, because I had a lot of key charges, so getting like a big big charge attack seems like a good idea. And fight fair. He doesn't fight fair, he's using clones and stuff. It's like two versus one, or even three versus one sometimes. Everything is fair in combat, it's like Jaquan said. Doesn't matter anything for the win. Ow, what are you doing here? Kind of want to like parry some stuff to get. Oh, never mind. Wanted to get some like charges up first. But I guess we'll get them during the fight. Also, there's this guy. There we go. Damn it. What happened? His clone just, like, vanished. I keep, like, mistiming that bow. Yeah, he just, like, vanishes so quick, it's very hard to land any attacks on him. Yeah, this is definitely the easiest move, that one. Excuse me for a second. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know when to, like, hit the bow stuff. Nope. I'm out. <laughs> that was weird. You just double jumped. That's my thing. Jesus Christ. You you just can't hit him with a bow. It's not possible. Okay. Calm down, man. Jesus Christ. Yeah, this guy is kind of weird. Like, you just can't hit him! He just disappears before you hit him every time! And then he just randomly doesn't do that and just stands still. I don't know, this guy is very strange. What? I blocked that. Oh, is that, like, one you can't block in the air, I guess? Come on! He's, like, there and he just doesn't get hit by the, the bow, ever. Yeah, just, like, dodging this guy makes more sense than trying to parry him. It's like, when you parry him, he doesn't actually get, like frozen in any way. Oh man. Yeah, this, this is definitely the weirdest mini boss fight we've seen. Like, many of his attacks just kind of don't make sense to me. Yeah, like that jump attack, you seemingly just have to unbounded counter, I guess. Or I forgot to pick up my soul, did I? I didn't even see it. Oh, not this way. Like, I don't even know where the soul would have been. This was too... God! Paying too much attention to the fight, I guess. Yeah, like that that attack, you just... You can't predict, so you can't, like, unbounded counter it, I feel.
And like, you only get one hit in at all times. It's so strange how just how little time you have to attack him. You basically just have to charge attack like one time. You like get one choice of attack. I guess full control might make more sense here. To just build up key charges and then do one big attack. Yeah, I don't know about this guy. And he's gone. Like, even a single attack is too much sometimes. You just don't get to hit him. Honestly, you could just cheese the fight by doing this constantly. Just get up, cancel the fight, charge attack him, get up, cancel the fight, charge attack him. Just keep doing that, I guess. Yep, this is, this is the honorable way to fight. Oops. Yeah, that, that part is just so weird to me, that, like, you just don't get to land any hits on him. He just, like, randomly decides if he wants to be hit or not, because if he wants to, he can just disappear, like, immediately. Or he just, like, like gives you tons of time for some random reason. Yeah, like, there he just randomly decided, I don't want to be hit today. Yeah, I don't know. This guy is weird. That's definitely the oddest fight we've had that, like, just doesn't feel good as a fight. Because it just feels like it's all RNG. Like, the boss controls if you get to hit him or not. I'm sure there's, like, things you can do to prevent that, but, yeah, it just didn't feel good. Aren't you gonna, like, teleport here? Yeah, I don't know how much Jin I lost. I don't think I had that much. I just wasn't paying attention. Oh yeah, that's just going here, which I don't want to do yet. And we just fight again? No, it's just more lore. Uh. Oh, really? Oh god, what is happening here? I don't know if I should, like, swap my stuff back. I guess we'll do this. Yeah, this is lore stuff. My fellow Solarians, they are corrupted. Good speech. I would like to share not just the end of this journey with everyone, but the start of a new one. Oh, actually, I have to advance. Ten years ago, we united to end the long night of the turbulent era, and ushered in the dawn of a new age, the origin era. They are corrupted. Well said. We once lost our way during the endless wars, but the rise of the Fangxi Guild has brought peace to our lands. Following in its footsteps is our obsession with power and our technology. What? Following in its footsteps is our obsession with power and our technology. What? Which have become our newest shackles. That is a weird sentence. Following in, in its foot, footsteps. In what footstep? I, like, forgot what the previous sentence said. Is our obsession with power and our technology. Like, our obsession with our technology, which have become our newest shackles. That is a very strange sentence. We will be disbanding the Fang- What? Impossible! The Fangxi Guild and sealing off all Fangxi technology. At the same time, any technology deemed beneficial for all Solarians will be made common property for all to use. All Fangxi- Is he serious? Returning to nature? All Fangxi will collectively go into hiding. We will return to nature to seek the Tao's true, true essence. 
It belongs to every living being, every piece of land, every drop of water. Today's decision may bring momentary turmoil, but I have faith that data corrupted. Is he just going to let go of all our hard-fought gains? For the Tao often acts through inaction. Data corrupted. Oh, I missed that, damn it. Lastly, no matter what the future may bring, please do not forget that we are all sojourners, sojourners, I don't know, under the starry sky. When was this decision made? Why were we not made aware? Let us protect Pengli together and create a future that belongs to all Solarians. We need to find a way to get out of Kunlun. Everyone just thought he was, like, going mad. Rejecting technology. I had, like, 4,000 Jin. I mean, I could just load a backup and do it again, but, like, eh, who cares? Jin is easy to get. Again, like, I didn't even see that I had a, a thing on the ground to pick up. Uh, yeah, what is happening here? Tau fruit? All of these are Tau fruit? Really? Oh, damn. Hit the jackpot. Thanks, old men. See, we already got 30. Basically got it all back. Rhizomatic bomb. This ancient weapon can be handed over to Kwafu. So I guess arrow type? Really? Another arrow type? I feel like three is enough. This tiny bomb is capable of raising an entire island. It is said to have been the final straw that broke the GA kingdom. It is remembered as the bringer of peace and the eternal stain, and an eternal stain, on the Fangxi Guild. Yeah, 30 bucks used to be like the whole treasure of the empire. I thought we were, like, completely done. I guess maybe we're just going in here to visit the old man and say, hey, I saw how people hated what you did, and it's not actually about, like, learning a new skill? Yeah, I mean, it's just kind of a bad idea to, like, leave a boss or mini-boss off to start off a stream with, because you're, like, not warmed up. I should have, like, had other stuff to do. Fellow Disciple, I'm glad I get to see you before I depart. Depart? I thought you couldn't return to the present world. My departure refers to a great to a returning to the Great Tao. Ever since the, that idea emerged, my mind has been growing fainter. It might not be appropriate for me to say this, but I can't help but envy your release. I see the confusion in your heart has yet to dissipate. My timer is about to reach its end. Would you humor me and let me share with you a time-worn fable? No. Of course, you have my undivided attention. Long, long ago, demonic spirits roamed the lands. Make it quicker, come on. Putting people's lives in dire straits. Among them, a demonic dog. Oh no, a dog! Filthy animals, sympathizing with the plight of the people decided to find the legendary demon-slaying sword. Along the way, he gained three extraordinary partners. An old snake spirit with unparalleled wisdom, a fearless tiger beast known for his boundless courage, and a charismatic demon fox known for her ability to charm any living, living creature. After countless trials and hardships, they finally retrieved the legendary sword. It's just like the plot to an anime. However, that's when the story takes a turn. They got rid of the demons, but peace did not prevail. You are well learned, my friend. The old snake, caught up in the infinite ocean of knowledge, lost his way. The brave tiger, having forgotten their purpose, abused his power. And the beautiful fox, jealous of all the attention and love the dog received, slowly began to harbor wicked thoughts. They had become the new demon menaces, so the demonic dog had no choice but to dispose of his former comrades. However, as he cut them down one after the other, that's when it dawned on him. This only made him the most powerful demon alive. Do you think he made the right decision, fellow disciple? For the sake of all sentient beings, that was the only option he had. I don't know. I mean, this is a, a lame thing to say, so I guess I'll say, yeah, he had no other choice, I guess. 
I used to share in that belief, but what is justice, good and evil, black and white? It all depends on the eye of the beholder. Before the great Tao, right or wrong may not matter at all. Are you that demonic dog? Are you a dog? I thought you were a cat. Aren't you a cat like me? Why couldn't it be you? Amidst this pitch black sky, we seek a sun that can illuminate the entire universe. But at what cost? What have we become? Cats. What am I supposed to do? Fret not, the answer is already in your heart. My time is up, ye. How do you know my name? I must bid farewell. You know my name? Yeah, that's the biggest plot twist in this game. Like, ye is actually a dog all along, not a cat. You know my name? Oh, here you go. Wait, I still have questions for you. Until next time, among the Great Tao. Pity, how I would have loved to see Peng Lai once more. Across time and space, bid farewell to Lear. Is that like floating? Floating just like he did above the bottom of my screen. Alright, yeah, it was just lore. Just goodbye, old man. Couldn't you have at least given us some like chakra power or something? Yeah, suddenly we have tons of level ups as well. Yeah, as soon as you get the double jump, you see him as well. And, like, it made it sound like that was the last time we would see him. Because he was like... What did he say again? He's like, you are fully... Fully fledged or whatever. Like, you have all the powers. Goodbye. I can teach you nothing more. It seemed like, oh, we're just gonna, like, leave that. Yeah, I kind of imagine most of the dialogue doesn't really change in a huge amount. Depending on like what you you choose. Well, now we need to make more money, I guess. So let's go back to that. And we can get this one, and I guess we'll save up one more and see if we can get Enhanced Key Blast. I think I want that, or do I want to leave that for later and get these first? Hmm. Because, yeah, like, this seems cool, but am I really going to use it that often? Using the bow is, like, an interesting way to, like, fight bosses and stuff, since, especially with a default arrow, since you can, like, stun them. So then if you can stun them, do a triple key blast, get another one, stun them again, triple key blast again, that could be pretty good. Yeah, I feel like that's more fun than just getting a little more damage. I don't even know how much this is. So, let's save up. What's the game plan for the rest of this area? I don't know. Game plan is kill everything, steal all the treasure, win, I guess. Oh. Hey, I have business with him. Oh, that's his completed pot, I guess. Hmm. This is for you, Uncle Chubby. Hmm. For me? It's a pallet vase. Who taught you how to make one of these? I asked Abacus what kind of gift you would like. He said that the people of Ying have a custom of painting stories on vases. Hmm. The glaze could have been applied more evenly, but for an ape man, it's passable. I... I actually had one I was more satisfied with, but ye broke it. No! What have I done? I should have, like, waited with this. Well, I got an achievement out of it, so it doesn't matter. Ye? Why would he do such a thing? They were in the way. It, it, it was an accident. Kind of. Ah, the perpetrator has come to confess. It's no big deal. It actually gave me a chance to practice some more. Yeah, exactly. That was my point. So what story did you paint on this vase? It's a story about me, Uncle Chubby, and ye living together here. Aww. Oh, me, Uncle Chubby, and ye living together here, I see. And is that... Ah, is that so? I see. He loves him. I see the tears welling up in your eyes. If you want to cry, you should just let it all out. Shut up, you're just seeing things. What? Did I do a bad job painting you? No, I just... This is the first time I've ever received a gift like this. Thanks, kid. And we're just a happy family. Break it. Nope. Yeah. 
big conversation here. No way! A rhizomatic bomb? So they really do exist. Is this... is it that infamous? You're the weird... you're the weird one for not knowing about it. This was the weapon that forced the GA Kingdom to surrender and thereby put an end to the turbulent era. Why have I never heard about this? Probably because you're from the Sia? Shia? I don't know. Taoists have always been reluctant to believe that Lear created such a weapon. Perhaps no one ever knew Lear for who he really was. So is it of any use? I'm going to need more time to tinker with it. If the rumors were even remotely credible, this bomb should be handled with extreme care. Yeah, it's like basically a nuke. And we're just like, hey, I found this. You want to like do something with this? One tiny slip up could level this entire pavilion. Okay. All right, so I guess nothing much. We just have to wait. No one else wants to talk. Yeah, no. Much do I have here? Not that much. Well, let's rest and see if that changes anything. No, I guess he actually needs more time, like, until after this area or something. Yeah. Alright, never mind. I wish Ruyi was, like, closer, because it's, it's so annoying to, like, have to walk all the way there. Or, like, maybe just get some sort of, like, tell that, oh, he actually wants to talk. So you didn't have to go all the way here and then be like, oh, nothing. Okay, all the way back. Alright, back to the grind. So... Uh, we still don't have the map for this area. I guess that might be after the boss. I guess we just go here and take this thing. We couldn't go up here, right? Could I? I don't remember, like... I think something was closed here, maybe? But maybe I should look at that. Hmm. Wait, so in that case, yeah, let's first go down here. And then these should be down, right? I think all of them are like, yeah. Laying down, so we should just be able to climb up here, right? Or what was the problem here? Yeah, I think I just opened this up. Yeah. But... Yeah, I see. There's just, like, nothing we can do here. Too high. Alright, yeah. I guess back to the... Is it better to sit here? Not really. We couldn't, like, drop down and do that. Doesn't work, yeah. Just gotta run all the way back. Ow.
All right, there we go. Now this, this part finally. Shame they put an invisible wall on the side of that, or you could have just like skipped that mini boss. Nice. Oh, I see. Oh no, you dropped those? No! What a horrible enemy! Yeah, you can't do that. Hmm. I don't like those. Yeah, I sometimes think of it as Jin as well. Or uh, Geo. Like a mix up Jin and Geo. Because of Hollow Knight. Hey, guy. What? Oh. Tutorial for this in case you haven't seen them. Ow! Don't kick me. Ow! Stop! So what did that do? Oh, that. Then can't I just, like, jump here as well? No, I see. We could go up here as well. I'm not sure which way is, like, the correct way. I'll just like not rest no reason to we need to find some statues again okay wait you can destroy them like before they start charging I guess oh no it's baby sword ba baby blade My worst nightmare. Ow! God, that's kind of cheap. You can't turn around like that. Alright, there we go. This area reminds me of Sekiro's soundtrack. I haven't played Sekiro, sadly. I think I would enjoy it. But I think I've heard some of the music, so I can kind of see, like, what you mean by that. I feel like something would be here. Nope. Death is here. Yep, no sneaky secret there. I, I don't know where I'm going. Like, I feel like going here is just going onward. There's so much I've just passed up. Hmm. Well, I guess we'll go down and fight this guy. We go now we can get the enhanced key blast oh that's just for getting back up again I see where are we going I'm just like skipping so much this is really weird I don't know if I'm just, like, accidentally taking the exact correct path that you're supposed to take to get through this area and everything else is a bonus, or if it's just very open. But now I kind of feel like I should go back and explore the other routes. What was the point of that?
Oops. Can I dash through here? Yeah. Oh god. Hello. One sec. Yeah, at this point in the game, it almost feels better to just, like, dodge stuff and not actually parry, like, unless you need to. Just dodging is, like, pretty reliable at this point, and just making use of charge attacks and what talismans and bow shots you have. In there. Yeah, I love how much you can just stay in the air with the charge attack and bow and talismans. gotten a new toy for Shunjun in a while. Nope. Herb Catalyst. Alright, that's fine too. I'm getting a lot of health, so the healing is actually, like, not that much anymore. Wait, was there anything else? Yeah. Top right. Oops. This guy's new, isn't he? I don't think we've seen these before. Wait, what? Ah, I see. This seems like a mini boss or something. Okay. Hello. Oh, no, is that that's someone I'm going to control? Oh no. No, it's not. Never mind. Whoa, that was a weird hitbox. It's it's Nightmare King Grim. What the hell? Oh, I don't have any more arrows. Too bad. Ow. Whoa, okay. He summons that under you, I guess. Yeah, these hitboxes are weird. They, like, hit very far behind him, too. Like, you can't really unbound counter anything, I feel. Yeah, once again, it's just like relying on charge attacks. I wasn't even parrying anything. One man army, defeat every optional mini boss. Really? Uh oh. Wait. What? Really? We have two more areas to go through. There are no optional mini bosses in those areas? Huh. 
That's weird. You want to explore more if you want achievement? Which achievement? Oh, here's this guy. Oh, don't even have any healing. Is this where we're going? It's really hard to tell, like, where you're actually going. Like, where is Ford in that sense? This also looks like an important place. I, I can't tell. Underground water tower. Water purification system warning. Warning, the water in the Empyrean district has been contaminated. Please seize all passenger related water, water deliveries. Floating atop the ruins of Yao Chi Lake, the Empyrean district is the council desi designated living and hibernation space for all Solarians. Wait, we're in the Empyrean district? What happened to the museum? Water and food is transported up the Sky Tower and stored in the district's lower levels. The Sky Tower extends further down, connecting to the Daybreak Tower on the surface and New Kunlun's research center deep underground. You have to defeat the mini-boss with that robot? Well, I mean, that doesn't really matter. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I know it's like we're not in the museum anymore, but I'm saying, like, what happened to the museum? Where else are we going in the museum? Because I don't remember, like, I can't get up here. It seems like in, instead we have to, yeah, like, just make it back here, I guess. Goes back to the museum. So you had to, like, take a round trip here. No, I can't even do that. Huh? I did see there was a nymph thing here, but... I thought I... or not a nymph thing, but a hack thing? Was it a nymph... nymph... god, nymph thing. That's very hard to say. Thank you, tutorial. Very exciting. Uh, now what? I guess we leave that for later and then turn these off, yeah. Just a standard component. Yeah, now we're like back here. I okay. Yeah, I guess we'll just go back. Wait, this is also something new. More standard components. Yep, okay. Well, let's head back, I suppose. I thought we would get to the, like, the Empyrean thing from... Hold on. From, like, going up... Like, here or something? No? Like, wait, yeah, it was there. No, it was... Where was it? I know there's, like, one screen somewhere where was that again here this place like jumping up here i guess i have to check that like is that just where we came from what is that again hmm yeah i want to check that 
Because it seemed like, oh, we need double jump to get up there, but I guess maybe that was just where I came from originally. Hold on, I want these. Actually, I don't really need them because I can just sit down up here. Okay, first off, let's just confirm. Yeah, that's not a nymph thing. Wait, but I can just take the elevator up. Oh, because I hacked the nymph thing. Okay, I just didn't notice that this was like an elevator. Because yeah, I, I saw that thing up there and thought like, oh, is that a nymph thing? But no, it's like a manual hack. All right. Let's get that, even though I might not use it. Yeah, Ryu mentions the three places you can go, but, like, not exactly how you get there. Just, like, vaguely, like, through this or this area, whatever, this or that. I don't quite remember. Uh, have you finished my thing yet, Chubby? No. Alright, well, let's just check this first, because I'm just curious if this is anything... It doesn't seem to be anything, because, like, there's nothing on the map. Three? What's the third? Uh, I forget. It's, like, Museum, the Empyrean District, and this, the Research Center. Though he did say something about, like, maybe we can't do the Research Center yet. But, I mean, now that I have the double jump, I think I can, yeah. Yeah, I haven't finished the Museum yet. So wait, I want to just go in here? It's time. Get ready. No, that's not where I want to be. It's Central Transport Hub. Okay, we, we got two Oya? Oh yeah? Nope. Not even the second one. Yeah, just here. Seemed very suspicious, but yeah, I guess this is just where we came from, and you're not meant to, like, go back? Oh, yeah. A daybreak Tower? I think that might be Empyrean. I'm not too sure. Alright, well, so that was nothing. Wait, is it Radiant Pagoda? No, Radiant Pagoda is where Guafu was. Right, I have a herb catalyst as well. Let's install that. I should have enough. Level 8, huh? Man, you get a lot of those. Do I even upgrade this? I mean, I assume it's like the last arrow type. So I guess there's no other reason to keep a dark steel, but like, I don't really like this one that much. I feel like both of the other other two are more reliable. But hell, maybe on that guy that kept like evading all my arrow shots, I should have used this one. So fine, I guess. Oh, we even need another one. Ah, Daybreak Tower is like the bell tower. Yeah. And yeah, we could do this now, but... Should I? Sure, let's try out Key Blast for a while, I guess. So if I get to, like, a boss fight, I'm probably sw swipping back. I keep doing that, like, switching and swapping in one word. Ah, 
Oh. Oh. And that's where we just came from. Okay. But, like, would that even have been open? Or was this open because I, like, had come from there? I mean, there's no hacking thing, so I guess you could have just gone in from here as well. What the hell is that weird pose? Oh, yeah, looks like boss time. Yep, and that's where we get the thing. But damn it, then I I don't want to do this. Hold on. Hmm, maybe we go for this one again. I wonder if he'll use a lot of a lot of projectiles. Kind of seems like we haven't had a theme like that, and this is the like telekinesis pseudo uh, psycho whatever dude. So maybe. Yeah, for now let's try this one, and we'll just see how it goes. How much money do I have? Not much, so it doesn't really matter. Alright. Hey, what's up, man? I got a fortune for you. Well met, my friend. My apologies, I'm just finishing up this last paragraph. Is it so important that you have to write it down right now? Every story needs an ending. Right. All done now. Welcome to my humble little library, my friend. It might look dreary, but many intriguing events from the past are etched into these pillars. So Soul G is still a chronicler. What other secrets are you hiding? Please, don't misunderstand. I only use these crystals for personal note-keeping. They help me recall memories worth remembering. It began as a casual hobby, but look at what it's become. Cut the chatter and give it to me straight. Why have you been secretly approaching me? I want to know more about you, that is all. Like a lighthouse standing tall in the night sky, great figures like yourself will always shine with a certain splendor. A splendor not dimmed by mortality. Eyeball boss. Oh dear. Great. Due perhaps to some divine prank, age means nothing to me. Impossible. How long have you lived? How could this be possible, right? I don't understand it either, even after several lifetimes. Why was I given this miracle? I have neither grand ambitions nor excessive desires. I have never coveted power, nor did I seek to bring about peace. Even on the brink of apocalypse, I did not feel the need to save anyone. Through every era, those that I've cared about always leave me behind. You're ageless and immortal. That's an ability that many can only dream of. That's true if you're a spectator, but for me it feels more like a curse. Alas, I also lack the courage to end this curse myself. Does my mentor, does Aegong know about this too? I don't get it. Why did you choose to join the council? The Chanhuo virus doesn't seem to have an effect on you at all. Mm. Staying in Penglai meant, it meant eternal loneliness, and I have endured enough loneliness. Besides, I he just wants friends. Can we just not be friends? Come to live in my pavilion. I made a promise, however meaningless, to protect this grotto for a friend. Just hand over your soul seal and I guarantee the grotto will not be harmed in any way. Oh, oh are you going easy on me? You never participated much in the council, and I'm not keen on exterminating the ancient Kunlun tribe. I just need your permission. Permission. I don't want to fight. But I have never disobeyed destiny. Have you forgotten already? I've always held great confidence in the answers my divination provides. What? What did you see in the hexagrams? I'm so sorry, but you will die by my hand today, Yi. Standing before you is the- I probably will, to be fair is the deputy captain of the Fangxi Guild Elite Guard, Sojourner G. May the clouds part and allow truth's light to illuminate our decisive battle. Can, can we get to it already? Stop, like, just... 
your overly verbose dialogue. <laughs> Indulge me with a sparring session, friend. There we go. What? What does it say? Jump on the ener energy orb. Okay. Oh, and then, like, we we select, like, what he will use? Wait. He just gave me some life. Hey, thanks, man. And he is using projectiles. Oh. Ow. Oh, Jesus Christ, that's a lot of damage. Okay. Yeah, he's the gambling boss. Yeah, that was kind of insane. And why does it have to be an elevator? Couldn't they just have put the, like, save point, like, here instead? Or one inside here? Kind of pointless to even, like, give me this one. What is that? Spiral? Is that good or bad? It's bad. Okay. Just a little black hole. So I want this one. Yeah, it's not even really gambling because you can just choose which one you want. So here, give me your health. What are you doing? Yeah, I, I don't know if having the like deflect thing would really do anything, because you can't really deflect these. I don't know what the third and final one does. Maybe I should check. I assume it's something bad. Let's try it, just to see what he does. Wind? Is that it? Like, that attack? Isn't that a normal attack? That seemed weird that that was like the only thing he did did with that. Wait, do I have Key Blast on? I forgot to change. I meant to have Water Flow. Oops. Now I didn't see which one was... Oh, and he, he chooses his own one if you don't do it in time. I see. Yeah, it seems fairly reliable to get the healing. Yeah, okay, I haven't been, like, stunning him at all. Ow, damn. That's the easy one to lock. Man, that, that is the easy move to dodge or to block, and I'm just not doing it. Hold on, I want this before phase two. Oh, he just gave me a, an arrow thing instead of healing. Okay, so that's like... Random gotcha boxes. It's time to end this. Oh, dear. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Jesus Christ. Okay, all right. <laughs> yeah, the, like, fortune-telling and uh, destiny boss is all about gacha games and gambling. Yep. Says a lot about society. So, like, this doesn't even do anything, then. We can just remove this one, because, like... He's not the one attacking, so I'm never really inflicting internal damage on him. So probably just go for this one instead, if I'm doing water flow anyway. And, like, 
This doesn't do anything either, right? Like, you can't deflect these, so getting rid of this to get this wouldn't do much. Hmm. Yeah, I might just go for this or something. And then, yeah, this one is the question. Maybe I should try this one out a bit more, but it's not, like, fully leveled up. I feel like maybe this one is better. Like, when he goes into gacha mode, I can do a full one of those. I'm just gonna grab it early. Like, right here. Oh, if I do it after he teleports, I think I have enough. Oops. Whoa. Okay. We're here. Okay, not sure what's happening with this one. Maybe you have to like stagger him out of it somehow. Just wait it out, I suppose. Yeah, maybe just... Okay, it, it just ends at that point. So I guess just, like, don't worry about it and wait until he's done. I mean, maybe I can get some damage in if I just, like, parry those daggers on the way. This does feel like a two-phase fight, not a three-phase, but I guess we'll see. new, right? Or, well, we saw it the first time. Whoa, 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 what is happening? What are you? Destroy it. I see, okay. Alright, that was something new and confusing. Okay, bot, just because someone else is allowed to link does not mean you are. Maybe I should, I should see how long you can, like, save those, if I can just have it on the floor for a while. I didn't know that. You can, like, use the arrow, the bow animation, to iframe stuff. Interesting. Like, you get a tiny bit of iframes during it. Oh, yeah, okay. Bad timing.
Ah, oh, damn. Wasted all that. Probably have to unbound counter that. Not like normal parry. Yeah. More gotcha. Oh, I did it too early again. I want to try and- Oh, Jesus Christ, I can multi-hit a lot. Holy crap. I really want to unbounded counter that one, but it's like hard to tell when it's happening. Yeah, it's like maybe I even want to- Instead of having the charge attack thing, I might want the down dash, so that when I see him... I, I could do that. Let's try that out. I'm just curious. When I see him do that, like, oh, I'm gonna jump up in the air and do a big staff hit. If I'm in the air, I don't have time to land and then unbound counter, but... If I have the down dash one, I probably, probably can. Let's try it out. It's like getting similar to the Lady Ethereal thing. Wanna parry this one attack? Would be fun to also try out the other attacks he gives you. Well, I, I already did, right? I tried all of them. There was like a whirlwind, there was the uh, black hole, and there's like loot, loot box. Are there any other ones in phase two? Like, does he change it? Because yeah, I thought I had like done everything. Oh, this one is new. Yeah. Or is that Black Hole? Oh, it's that one. I see. So, like, he does do most of the attacks, like, naturally as well. It's just, like, with the gotcha thing, he just does, like, a specific attack as well. Just to try out this one. I guess it's just him throwing some daggers. Okay, that's not super interesting. Are there any other ones I haven't done? Do it there. Ah, he just does it when I'm like not expecting it. Oops. God damn it. I want to parry that. I don't want to dodge it. It's easy to dodge, but I want to parry it.
Oops. Oh, wow, his hitbox, like, extends very far down. Hmm, nope. Hold on. Just, just in case I kill him, I want to save a, uh, a backup here because I need to know if you can unbound counter that and if something cool happens, like a stun or whatever. So I'm just going to save the backups before I kill him. Not that I will kill him this attempt, but just in case. Okay, well, now we, now we know. It was that easy. If I didn't make the backup, I wouldn't have gotten that. It's like, because that I did that, I altered history. And that's it. Oh, I thought he was doing like a final, like, I'm gonna kill you with an insta-kill attack at the end, but I couldn't even dodge. How nostalgic. Your moves feel exactly like his. Yeah, that was, that was again, like, a fun fight that I honestly wish was longer. I, I wish it was, like, a phase three. Same with Jiaquan. It appears that your hexagrams have failed you. If I told you the results, would you still have tried your utmost? At least one of us got to enjoy the thrill of the unknown. You lied to me? A good story needs an interesting twist, does it not? Is this the end? I have witnessed the springs of Tian Shan burst forth and dry out. Oh dear. I've seen the long shadows cast by mountains of corpses as night fell at Feng Shan. I was there when Dong Huang, the Dong Huang bell rang for the first time. I walked through countless cities drowned in time. But all those memories will be lost in time. You know the rest. All of it has now attained wholeness within the Tao. Like a shooting star that sears its mark between heaven and earth. Time to die. Yeah, man. The bosses in this game are so good, I just want more of them. Like, not more bosses in the amount of them, just like, I want the bosses to be bigger and badder. Would be cool if there was like a new game plus thing that like made the bosses have like twice the health or whatever and maybe have like new attacks or something. G's hair. A strand of hair thing from G. Its specific purpose is unclear. G's corpse never showed any signs of decay. The usual Chun Ho flowers were also absent. Oh yeah, we didn't get a greater Tao fruit. Because he like wasn't one of us, I guess. He was an older race in that sense. All right. Rest in peace. I mean, I guess we kind of did what he wanted. He was like born an oracle, I guess. Guardian of life, master of time, we worship you. And he's like, I just want a friend. I, Ji Tong, born as a warrior, shall perish as a hero. And, and you committed suicide? That doesn't seem like a heroic end to me. Farewell, my friend. The struggles of life and death no longer concern me. He's like watching all of these great figures of history, like, disappear, I suppose. We have finally transcended our destiny with our own hands. We are no longer mortal. Yeah, I know that's Jiatong, his ancestor. Yeah, I feel like you probably need to like rewatch the whole game or reread everything to like really understand the full story. All of it has now attained wholeness within the Tao. The only thing I wish 
for that boss fight was that I kind of wish you actually could, like, deflect those projectiles so that a deflection build would finally be, like, useful. Having that, like, partial deflect more deflect damage thing for projectiles be a thing. It would be nice to have a boss that was focused on that, like, parrying lots of projectiles to, like, reflect the damage or something like that. G's soul seal containing the character Gui. Gui? I don't know. Signifies insight. Yeah, I think I think that was pretty much clarified that he like wanted to fight G because he wanted G to kill him because he didn't have the courage to kill himself. And he had like he told me the prophecy was that he would kill me, but in fact he lied because the prophecy was actually that he would die by my hands or whatever. Hello. Oh, your fishbowl is empty. Booting, loading, initializing. Hello, thank you for using the Shanghai 1000 testing model. I see. He's got a very, very old model sitting around here. I am the latest assistive robot capable of deep learning through conversation. Oh, did it see you look like Rainworld's Max Karma thing? I didn't see that. Feel free to browse the database or engage me in in-depth Q&A. Shanghai 1000? Is this a prototype? What an antique. Yeah, sure. Incorrect. That command does not exist in the database. It doesn't seem too bright. Incorrect. That command does not exist in the database. Give me a status report on this region. Incorrect. That command does not exist in the database. Help. Type help slash help. Question mark. Command list. Slash deer. Come on, do something. What were you made to do? That's not going to work. Incorrect. None of these are going to work. Why are you in his warehouse? Keyword confirmed. G. Okay, there we go. Loading G's latest development log. First month of year 3773. Turbulent era. We installed the third iteration of the head. I wanted to put... Is that like his voice? It's like playing back a recording. I wanted to put a real fish inside, but the maintenance would have been too costly. It ended up being a display instead. I see. I wanted to fill it with water due to the whole design concept. This robot... Why did they design it as a fishbowl then? Like... It's like... Because it looks like a fishbowl, I want to fill it with water and put fish in it. But why does it look like a fishbowl? <laughs> uh, this robot would represent the seas and mountains of Peng Lai. Lear told me that I didn't need to use its appearance to symbolize Peng Lai. He kept asking me to cut features from the Shanghai 1000. So did... Did G G made like make all of the Shanghai Shanghai robots, or did they just like take his design and then mass produce them or something? Uh, to make it more practical, but I don't want it to be mass produced. Oh well, there you go. But I guess they did it anyway. Spectators innately understand that fireworks from afar always look prettier than those in your your midst. I wonder how many more years will I be able to converse with him? What were you made to do? Shanghai is a public welfare experiment funded by the Fangxi Guild. I can look up information, play audio files, calculate mathematical equations, and make noodles. The purpose of the Shanghai 1000 shifted constantly through its 50-year development period. It currently has no clear purpose. You make noodles, that's your purpose. Please contact the developers if you would like to purchase one. You were there when the Fangxi Guild was still active? Keyword confirmed Fangxi Guild retrieving. The Fangxi Guild is an international scientific organization founded by the thinker Lear. Its purpose was to put an end to all wars. Lear believed that peace could be found using science, so he gathered those with lofty ideals, and together they built a research complex on the island of Kunlun. Today, the Guild is home to the most advanced technology on Penglai, as demonstrated in Kunlun's sustainable development zone. The Guild's technology spread to every corner of the world and helped to end the century-long food and energy crisis. However, Lear has also been launching non-compliance movements due to each nation's lack of interest in his anti-war initiatives. This move has paralyzed operations in all major governments and institutions. Goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you for your patronage. Feel free to leave a review and any comments about your experience. Later. Give me your chip. Hello, Suff. Warning, removing- you just missed, like, a big boss fight. Now it's probably just, like, the rest of the stream is talking. 
in case you were wondering about this game. It's very good. I recommend it. Removing the map data chip will cause irreversible damage. To transfer image assets, it is recommended that you provide 400 physical units to obtain a copy. Yep. Confirmed and connected with the payments. Replicating map data. The mysterious grotto of scriptures was once the Fangxi Guild's headquarters. Ji had been as, had been maintaining and protecting these caves for centuries after Lyra's passing. Yep, yeah, there we go. Yep, yeah, the boss fights in this game are incredibly amazing. I'm just loving like all of this game pretty much. Oh, music. Rooster step, I love it. It's like ancient radio. It's like random animal noises and just like radio FM. Yeah, I'm sure G was like a massive hipster. Just like music used to be better in the old days. I don't know what these kids are listening to these days. People singing oh yeah all the time. Alright, so I guess that's the museum done. And? Are we actually done with the new, like, bomb thing that Kwafu had? Wait, hold on. There we go. Screw elevators. You got G's soul seal? So did you ever figure out, figure out what he was? It was always a mystery to me how someone so little could sound like a living antique. So, you've actually met G? Oh? Of course I have. You read my fortune and said I would spend the rest of my life away from my hometown. What nonsense. He even invited me to the Grotto of Scriptures, saying he wanted to show me a secret no one's ever a bit seen before. Was that his idea of a joke? Everyone knows the Grotto's biggest secret is the Grave of Lear, which no one can seem to find. <laughs> Who would ever want to step foot in those catacombs? It must be crawling with countless vengeful Fengxi souls. I have just, like, finished raiding the whole place, stealing all their artifacts and, like, ancient treasures, and killed all those ghosts. Thank you very much. Yeah, he's still not done with whatever he was doing. Maybe that's, like, once we're completely done with all three remaining ones, or, like, the very ending. To be frank, I know one or two things about face reading. Would you be interested in allowing me a look? Back from the grotto and the first thing I see is another fortune teller. Fine, let's hear it. You have a wide forehead, along with a thin, narrow nose. A calamitous sign. It's just a cat, man. Hoarding wealth will harm you a hundredfold. Well, I, good thing I lost like 4,000, so I guess I'm not hoarding it. Whereas spending it will bring you good fortune. I have here a collection of one-of-a-kind treasures, never to be seen again, again once sold. Would you like to take a look? Your face reading needs a lot of work, but I think you get the gist of it. Well, do you actually have some new stuff? Nope. Nothing new. Yeah, we're definitely hurting in the money departments. How much is this? 2,900? Do you believe in any gods, ye? The village elders always told us to believe in the gods. They said doing so would make us healthy, give us good looks, and give us boneless meat to eat. I love boneless meat. I mean, do you believe it? I mean, do you believe in gods? Kind of? It'd be nice if the gods turn out to be true. But not every question has an answer, right? I suppose. Oh, god damn it! It's so easy to skip. It's not like I something. Ugh. Yeah. If anyone wants to go through the trouble of clipping and checking what that actually said, feel free. That boy Shunshin is using stones to tell fortunes. He must have learned it from the villagers. What a disgrace. Our village must seem like a complete joke to you people. Not really. We also do divinations. Abacus was probably the only one who taught him that. Uh, was probably the one. What? How can that be? 
You can fly and create contraptions, but you still believe in these formless ideas? Faith is used to control the ignorant. You're not supposed to be that gullible. I used to ponder the same conundrum, but maybe there's a reason why faith can't be replaced. And that's all we can do now. And Rui? My lord, don't you think there are quite a few similarities between Shenshen and Hung? The results of their personality analyses are also quite similar. If your humble servant could express an opinion, having Shenzhen wake you up was the most incredible stroke of luck I've ever witnessed. Yep. And I guess like Yi is kind of like trying to what's the word? Not like redeem. What's what's the word again? Like make up for losing his sister by like raising Shenzhen in the same way. Or like being a mentor and whatever. A tone. That was the word I was looking for. Yeah, I guess that's everything here. Let's rest once and see if anything changes. It's not like I'll ever know if that Oracle's divination was accurate. Wait, really? It's, that it's not like I'll ever know that if that oracle's divination was ever accurate now. That's also kind of a strange sentence. Oh, right. Map data. Yeah, thank you. If you're all the same model, why do you all talk so differently? You Solarians all talk the same? Is that a fair comparison? Go ask people who made us. If I could, I wouldn't be asking you. Good talk. Wait, and anything else? Wafu is just up there. And nothing much here, yeah. Yeah, I, I just killed their creator. So no one to ask anymore. Yeah, we still need another one for this. I think I'm gonna, like, hold off on this one, because I, I do it so seldomly and you still get two anyway, so it doesn't really feel like you need three from this one. Man, I want to play more, but yeah, it's, it's like a good time to end it, really. I'm probably gonna play more tomorrow, though. Yeah, I should probably leave it off. Hold on, let's, let's just check the map to see, like, did I miss any secrets here? I did not. No, go up there. What are you doing? I can't, like, go to that screen. It doesn't allow me. That's annoying. Yeah, it just doesn't let you. Wait, hold on. With keyboard, maybe? Nope. I just, I can't get to that screen. It's not possible. All right. Never mind. Yeah. Maybe it's just bugged, I don't know. Or maybe I just have to, like, get over there so that I can get in there and... Oh, okay, now it just works. What the hell, man? Hey, yeah, looks like we didn't have any other collectibles in this zone. So yeah, next time we could either continue here, but honestly, I kind of feel like I want to go to the research center. That seems interesting. I'll probably go here and leave the... What was this called again? Empyrean District for last? Something like that? But yeah, looks like we're kind of nearing the end, probably, like this one, this one, and then I guess it's like big grandma boss fight or something. I don't know. We'll see. But yeah, good progress. One zone done, museum done, G done. And yeah, just two more regions, seemingly, to go. So I'll probably stream this more tomorrow in some tunic. So join me then if you want to see more. Thanks for watching. Have a good night.